Job 28 describes one of the most valuable, even priceless treasures one can gain in this life, wisdom. In this chapter, we read of wisdom as something to be found in comparison to the way precious metals are mined out of the earth. Yet wisdom cannot be seen, even in the depths of the earth, where these precious metals and valuable jewels can be found. People throughout history have developed elaborate ways to uncover precious metals and stones of great value. However, the Bible describes these treasures as worthless and their ability to be traded for wisdom. So, where can true wisdom be found? Verse 23 of chapter 28 says, God alone understands the way to wisdom. He knows where it can be found. And in verse 27, then he, speaking of God, saw wisdom and evaluated it. He set it in place and examined it thoroughly. And this is what he says to all humanity. The fear of the Lord is true wisdom. To forsake evil is real understanding. I remember a conversation I had with a dear friend shortly after I became a Christian. In my college years, this friend and I searched for answers to the biggest questions of life and purpose. What is the right way to go? Where can we find truth? Where can we find satisfaction to this hunger and thirst in the deepest parts of our soul? We would talk about it. We would think about it. We searched the earth for it. One day, I found the answer to these questions in the person of Jesus Christ. Salvation in Christ opened my eyes to true wisdom and finally satisfied the deepest needs of my heart. I couldn't wait to tell my friend. I went to him and revealed this spiritual treasure that beamed from my face like a jewel. Unfortunately, my friend didn't receive it well, so we went our different ways. But I knew that what I had found was a priceless treasure far beyond any value I could ever understand, the gift of eternal life with God. You see, the human heart is searching for that which will satisfy. We all search the earth for it, but God invites us into a life with himself in Jesus Christ. And that begins our real understanding of truth and wisdom. So let's be reminded today that God alone is the source of true wisdom. His word reveals his nature to us, and he alone is our way to real understanding and true wisdom.